Outlander began with Claire Randall traveling back in time when she touched the stones at Craig Naughton. She was transported back to 18th century Scotland where she met Highlander Jamie Fraser and they fell in love. While Claire appears shocked by the whole thing, one fan thinks Claire knew what was happening and left a secret message for husband Frank Randall. The first episode of Outlander began with Claire, played by Katrina Balfe, and her husband Frank Randall, Tobias Menzies, on honeymoon in Inverness. The couple could be seen exploring castles and battlefields, but halfway through the episode, Something extraordinary happens, Claire touches the stones at Craig Nodon and is transported back in time. Frank was devastated when he realized his wife had gone missing but did Claire know what she was doing all along? Claire was baffled when she ended up in the 18th century and on herself faced with the menacing Captain Jack Randall, also Tobias Menzies. Fortunately, she was rescued by Murtaugh Fitzgibbons, Duncan Lacroix, which led to her meeting Jamie Fraser, Sam Hewen. Fans know Claire and Jamie eventually fall in love but one fan thinks they've spotted a clue which reveals the healer knew she could travel back in time. They think she had a plan to go through the stones and left a message for her husband Frank telling him never to forget her. Reddit user Grandisp explained, so the flowers by the stones in season 1 episode 1. This has been bugging me because I thought they were forget-me-nots. And I think when she tells Frank she's going to go back to the stones to look for them again I think she says they are maybe forget-me-nots. But then, if you watch the little bit of scene when she and Frank are there after the dancers, from afar they are these aster-type flowers, the close-up is forget-me-nots, and then back out from afar to the asters. I believe when she goes back the next day or whenever without Frank, they are asters again. I need to go hunt down my book to see what it says in there. The fan added, I thought there was some significance to the flowers, maybe much 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 later like at the end of the whole series book 10, and the show has been so so good about things being genuine. Could Claire have left the forget-me-nots for Frank as she had secretly planned to time travel? While it seems unlikely Claire would have decided to travel back in time without being more prepared. Fans know she made sure she had penicillin and money and was dressed appropriately when she traveled back in time in season 3, the flowers are significant. Another fan replied, DG has said the forget-me-nots are significant and did tell the showrunners that. We readers don't know why yet, and I don't know if the show is actually going anything with them. Could the flowers be linked to Jamie's ghost in episode 1? Diana has explained the ghost is Jamie about 25 years old and the reason why he was watching Claire at her hotel window will be revealed at the very end of the series. However, some fans have speculated the ghost is Jamie after he died at the Battle of Culloden and lured Claire back to the 18th century to help him survive, which would explain why she left a message for Frank. Reddit user and Mirror explained, what if, the ghost of Jamie in S1 was not the ghost of the Jamie we know, but the ghost of the Jamie who died in Culloden and never knew Claire. Destined to wander, he came across Claire and beckoned her to the past and to the stones. That's how she got attached to the timeline through the stones she was attached to. Thus creating a new timeline for himself with her in it, among other things saving him from an early death. 